Welcome to jobscliche.com. This video is just an information video about this section that I created Microsoft 2013 Office and uh, it has uh, everything new in there. The reason I'm sharing this is this is a great hands-on labs from Microsoft. Uh, you guys should definitely take advantage of it. It has a lot of information about Office 2013, 365, Exchange and more. You guys definitely need to take a look into this. Um, it's it's brand new labs from Microsoft. I would uh, if I will if I'm a help this technician or anyone in IT that's going through this course, I would really go through this stuff because this is this is future. This is coming in to the companies. A lot of companies are going to uh, start on this, so it would be nice to have a um, uh, you already have a training on it. So what I did, uh, I have an external link on uh, on the top right here, and then you can also use this uh, course uh, if you don't want to get out of this system. Uh, I'll just show you guys how to uh, do a full screen first inside the course. So if you go to the section here and on the if you click on this little arrow, you see it it's uh, full screen then. So now you can click on get started with the new office. Once you click on that that's from the Microsoft this is not from me so um, again this is great stuff I mean if I start making videos it's gonna take me m uh, almost months to come up with something like this it's great that they already have something like that so introduction to the new office part one is it's also great actually links for your users so you know sometimes like do we have any training is someone gonna give us some training and you get these kind of calls um, to in realistic world this is a ticket for you actually so somebody sends you a message that hey we got 2013 office but we need training from IT or maybe you need to train them or something this is a great resource for you guys this the introduction to um, new office so you click on that and it has a very nice step-by-step -step information in there so it's uh, loading right now click on play and then you get some information from Microsoft uh, click skip and this part one tells you what they're gonna cover Outlook Word OneNote app so and this is just a little information that tells you what to do so you get this screen and on the right side you get like you know uh, in writing uh, stuff so once you read this stuff uh, this is going to start exactly and it's gonna ask you to do things that's a great part of this lab said that it makes you do things so click on the Outlook 2013 and it takes you there and then step by step you start doing that now um, in in this uh, in my, when when it's integrated in my course you don't see on the bottom there's nothing like you you can make it for we can forward it like you know the it's like blank uh, bl blanked out so what you do is if you wanna try the external link I would suggest that if you guys wanna do that so when you click on that once you go to the course again click on this external link and now it's gonna take you to the Microsoft site okay here if you click on this let's say let's click on another one let's get started with exchange one another good one and definitely a must um, uh, one for or for you guys to have because sometimes let me tell you in a uh, real world you guys will be playing around with exchange administ administration center uh, users will call you that my this uh, person sent me an email from this email address and she's complaining that she um, uh, she sent the email but I don't see it and she said that she did like three or four times that means something happened either in your web filter uh, caught it because it has attachment that uh, your web filter didn't like or maybe your exchange um, stopped it because there was just some kind of character uh, in your uh, in their body or something something like that in the email body that the exchange didn't like and it blocked it, it never, and so it never received it never got um, it never reached the destination so what you need to do your troubleshooting starts from here you go to Microsoft Exchange Administration Center then you're gonna start looking around and see what's going on so if I click on this it has also hands-on videos so it will open up right now you'll go in there and the difference between inside my course and this one, it, it has this on the bottom, this little, uh, uh, like, you know, forward thing. So when you click on next, you can easily, if you don't want to wait for this little screen and you want to go back, you can easily just do this. And you see it's pretty fast. If you wait for that on the right side, it's going to take you a little time. So it is basically a great 
Microsoft uh, training you can learn exactly hands on one on one step and then once you once you learn this you can uh, fire up the real machines and then play around with a little bit more but this at least gives you some kind of information great resource for users or for new IT personnel that you want them to get trained on this is a great resource for them to have um, like I said it has a lot of information so you we can't just cover this in the videos it will take me so much time to just go through all this stuff and it has some extra information that I wasn't going to cover and help this but you still have the access to it so definitely try it it will be definitely beneficial for you uh, and for anyone who uh, wants to learn 2013 um, and up Microsoft stuff Alright, hopefully this was a good information for you guys. See you guys in a different video. Bye-bye.